Hey, it's Howard Spencer from Coldwell Banker, and welcome to episode three of Real Estate Term Tuesday, where today we're going to learn about what a short sale is. You may have heard this term before and wondered what it was, but a short sale is a real estate offer on a property at an asking price that is less than the amount due on the current owner's mortgage. It's usually a sign of financially distressed homeowner who needs to sell a property before the lender seizes it in a foreclosure. Now, all the proceeds of a short sale at the final closing table go directly to the lender. Sometimes you can negotiate a relocation fee for the owner to move to another property or move the stuff out of a property. Then the lender has two options to forgive the remaining balance or to pursue a deficiency judgment that requires the former homeowner to pay the lender all or part of the difference. In some states, the difference in the price must be forgiven. So this will be negotiated with your short sale attorney. Now, short sale also has to be approved by the lender before you can go to closing. Financial consequences of a short sale may be less severe than a foreclosure, and most of the time, the bank will work with you, the owner of the home, in selling the home before foreclosure. That way, you know everybody gets paid and the, the financial institution doesn't accrue any more cost to them, attorneys and interest and going through the court and having to evict the person from the property. So also, if there's more than one lien on the property, Everybody has to agree to it. So it's kind of like a group effort. If one person says no, the whole deal is off. So thinking about a short sale, give me a call. I can fill you in on it. Thanks for joining us. Catch you next week.